Hey there guys, welcome back to the MyGuy YouTube channel. Got a fascinating light today for you. This is by Photon Tech, who are the US brand of Lumatech, long established. And they're one of my favorite brands, really high quality fixtures, been going a long time, and uh, yeah, really, really reliable. This is the 1000 watt CO2 Pro model. It's an interesting angle this light has. It's pushing the power intensity levels for the grow area way above what people have been used to growing before, hence the CO2 name. And yeah, we're gonna talk about that in a minute and what are the implications of that and, and setup and everything like that. In the meantime, let's have a look at the features and uh, yeah, let's see what this light can do. So not only is this a very powerful fixture at just over a thousand watts, it's the most powerful LED grow light I've ever tested, but it's also physically very big. You can see here it's four foot by four foot, which gives it a really good spread over its chosen five foot by five foot grow area. It goes together really simply. And the black frame here, it's literally snaps together. The 10 LED bars, again, snap into place and held in place magnetically. Driver then sits on top. Got a really generous power lead. It's about 13 foot long or about four meters long, which is really great. And yeah, you can get multiple connections. So as you can see, it's ridiculously bright under here. Um, it is only at 25% at the moment. You get the free dimmer with the light um, to adjust in increments of 25% from zero up to 100%. You can also then uh, purchase the additional Photon Tech controller and lots of fancy controls for timing function and dimming function and everything else for multiple units. The spectrum itself is a mixture of mid um, color temperature white Lumi LEDs and red Osrams. So perfect spectrum from growing full cycle all the way from seed to flower. So we put this big beast of a light into its um, specified five foot by five foot grow area. Not the normal target, but I targeted 1500 micromoles as the maximum power value in the center. Normally I'd only tar target only a thousand micromoles, but obviously this light is, look is looking to um, surpass those levels found that optimum hanging height to be 20 inches from the canopy to the underside of the light or the test, air, test area to the underside of the light in this case. And we divided it up into 100 um, squares, so 10 by 10 grid. And we took 100 measurements with the Apogee SQ500 quantum sensor. And incredibly, just over 1000 watts consumed, this light delivers over two and a half thousand micromoles, which is a 2.45 micromoles per watt, or usable PPF per watt, which is a very, very good efficiency. The um, average power across the whole grow area is 1100 micromoles, which again is an extraordinary level. Now, this compared to the equivalent highest end double-ended HPS, would be, which would be around uh, 1500 micromoles. This fixture around the same wattage delivers 60% more power in a five by five than the best double-ended HID available. And um, because of the lower, relative lower power consumption, it would be about um, 30 to 40% less heat for the power delivered in that grow area. So it's really incredible and um, quite a development in terms of its tech. Next question though is whether it is worth pushing your power levels up to that level. You know, what I would have recommended before, certainly to your sort of normal home grower in particular, would be not to push your power level much over sort of seven or 800 micromoles average in your grow canopy. And this is because once you go over that level with the normal environment, the plants are not able to uptake all of that light efficiently and you get a decreasing return the more light that you add to the grow area. However, as the name indicates, this is designed to be run with supplemental CO2 and all the science and research shows, as this graph shows, that if you push, if you supplement with CO2, sort of three to four times the normal level of about 400 um, parts per million, up to around 12 to 1400 parts per million, the line straightens up and you do get a continuously increasing return for the increasing amount of um, power that you're uh, uh, giving the plants, the higher light intensity that you're delivering to the plants. So it shows that you can 
get more growth out of the same space, the same square footage with a fixture like this, as long as you're supplementing your CO2 uh, um, with, with a closed environment. So if you're the kind of grower, you can take advantage of the high light levels, high power intensity that this light generates, and you can dial in your environment, in particular supplement CO2 to the levels needed to take advantage of this high power. Then we are working with Photon Tech and it'd be great for you to support the channel and click on the link below, which also gives you a discount from their uh, website, their US website, where you can buy direct from. If you're not from the US, uh, their equivalent Lumatech brand in Europe is um, the, as I said, the Lumatech 1000 Watt Pro CO2 Model 2. The link is down there for that as well. And you can click on that and find a distributor in Europe. And yeah, so that's about it. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and I'll get back to them as soon as possible. Take care.